morning, friends. Greetings and welcome to The Bright Side, your nutritional program dedicated to the understanding of the vast world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. I'm your host, Pharmacist Ben, nutritional pharmacist from Boulder, Colorado. I use nutritional supplements in my practice where other healthcare practitioners use toxic pharmaceutical drugs and sometimes deadly medical procedures. If you suspect that there are natural nutritional roads to your vitality and health and well-being and to addressing your health challenges, whatever they may be, but you don't know where to begin, you have come to the right place. As you listen to The Bright Side every day, you are more and more in control of your body, you are more and more knowledgeable, and you know you can overcome any health issue. That's why we're here every day on The Bright Side to help clear up the sometimes confusing world of nutrition and nutritional supplementation. Over the last 29 years of practicing pharmacy, I have seen drug-free recoveries from diabetes and hypertension and obesity and skin diseases like acne, psoriasis, eczema, rosacea, digestive ailments, autoimmune issues of all kinds. Recoveries that by the standards of modern medicine can only be called a miracle. But what is in the world of the body, what is in the world of biology, standard operating procedure. Because the human body is a healing system, a regenerating system. It is designed divinely to heal and renew itself on a moment-to-moment basis. And while some folks may call that a miracle, it really is just the way the body works. If you are dealing with a chronic health challenge, if you're dealing with a degenerative disease, please understand it is unnecessary. You can reverse it because the body can reverse it. It's in the body's nature to heal, and we can help you do that. We want to help change your life today. If you're dealing with arthritis or acne or atherosclerosis or digestive health issues, please let us show you how simple and easy it can be to begin the reversal process immediately, right away. And you can notice results within 24 hours if you do this correctly. Our number is 844-236-6010, 844-236-6010. If you want to help a loved one or workmate or friend or family member deal with a chronic health issue or get off prescription drugs and get on a good nutritional supplement program, we can help you do that. 844-236-6010 is our number. I've been doing this for decades, folks, and I can't tell you how many times I've seen dramatic, dramatic reversals from every disease you can name, including cancer, and I've seen it with my own eyes. 844-236-6010 is our number. If you want to purchase any of the longevity products you hear advertised on the program, you can call the Brightside Ben phone team at 866-735-2470, or you can head over to brightsideben.com, criticalhealthnews.com, or pharmacistben.com. You can purchase products or sign up to join the Brightside Ben team right off the websites. Love to have you on my team. You can start yourself a little business if you want to make a residual income or you want to make a, a nice income. And, of course, you can do it all while you're helping spread the word about the power and importance of a good nutritional supplement program while you're helping people at the most fundamental level, which is the level of health. You've been following politics and following the debates and listening to the news. You know that where everybody's up in arms about terrorism and the economy and immigration. But you know what, folks? As important as these issues may be, there is nothing, nothing, nothing more important than our health and as soon as somebody gets sick, it's not very, it, it doesn't take very long for all of these other seemingly important issues to, uh, to become, uh, to get put back on the back burner where they really belong. It's about our health. Our health is the most important priority, as important as these other issues may be. If you want to purchase any of our Truth Skin Health products, please go over to uh, truthtreatments.com. Check out our Retinol 5% Gel, and also you can check out our blog, truthtreatments.com. And you can also check out my Facebook page, The Truth With Ben. I blog on that as well about skin health issues. Okay, so we're continuing with our discussion on fats and fatty vitamins and cells and inflammation, or more accurately, microinflammation. That's the inflammatory process as it takes place at the teeny tiny invisible level of a cell. And really, as all of these factors, as all of these distinctions, as we call them, relate to our health or lack thereof. By the way, the ultimate classic disease associated with the inflammatory process, the microinflammatory process, is cancer. And you hear from doctors all the time, you hear from the medical professionals and the medical representatives all the time, we don't know what causes cancer. There's hundreds of different types of cancers and cancer will never be cured and we can't cure cancer. We have to cure cancer. We're going to spend all this money to cure cancer and Joe Biden is now in charge of our war on cancer, which has been going on, by the way, since President Nixon in the 1970s first declared it. 
and trillions of dollars in, in research costs and tax money and everything else you can think of that uh, all other forms of income that you can think of are contributed to the so-called war on cancer and we got more cancer than ever before. Surprise, surprise. Because it's not really a mystery. It's a degenerative non-healing process like all degenerative non-healing processes. It's inflammation, which as we said, microinflammation in the case of the cells, is like an airbag that surrounds cells to protect them, but ultimately when it's chronic, causes them to die, causes them to starve, causes them to be suffocated, causes them to uh, swim in their own toxicity and waste, which they no longer have an ability to drain away because of this beaver's dam, because of this airbag called inflammation. That means that all the strategies we talk about on this program every day for addressing diabetes, for addressing arthritis, for addressing autoimmune disease, for addressing any degenerative, chronic, non-healing health challenge are also anti-cancer strategies. Correcting digestive health, patching up the gut, keeping the blood clear of food toxins and allergens and uh, keeping inflammatory factors, micro-inflammatory factors at bay. And that includes sugar. Sugar is a micro-inflammatory factor. That's why it's problematic. It, it induces inflammation. Making sure your blood is oxygenated, using deep breathing techniques, circulation stimulating techniques, getting on a rebounder. All of these are anti-cancer strategies too. They're anti-everything, every disease strategy you can think of. Does all this sound simple? Does all this sound too simple to be true? Well, it is simple and it should be simple because health is simple. This is really, really a fundamental idea. And it's the best news anybody with a chronic degenerative health issue will hear. It's the bright side, it's the good news. And I'm guilty of ripping on the medical model, but ultimately it doesn't matter because we have power, we have control. And while diseases and symptoms may look complex on the surface, underneath there's just a few simple mechanisms. And science is understanding this when it comes to physics. They call it simplexity or complexity theory. It's fundamental physics. This is not airy fairy, Boulder, Colorado, hippy dippy talk. This is hardcore science, hardcore physics. It's called complexity theory in, in physics, and it, it's used by scientists to understand shapes and patterns in the universe. Everything from stars and galaxies to trees to forests to broccoli flor uh, florets to butterfly wings to the human body. It says that underneath what appears to be complex is simple phenomena, simple equations, really. Alan Turing, who uh, is considered the father of the modern uh, modern computer, or modern computer science anyway, was this brilliant mathematician in England. He was born in the early 1900s, and he was profiled in this movie, The Imitation Game, which you may have seen. It came out a couple years ago. He was the first guy to really talk about this idea of the simple equations or the simple repeating patterns that are underneath the most complex of phenomena. He said, he was a mathematician, so he looked at things via math, and he said that underneath everything in the universe, flowers and the, uh, actually he, what he studied was the development of the embryo. He was blown away by how cells, uh, in the, in, when a baby is being born, a fetus is being developed inside of the womb, it all starts off with these simple cells and somehow or another, these simple little cells, which are all the same when they begin, somehow or another they turn into eye cells and skin cells and bone cells and liver cells and all the other hundreds of cells in the body. This is a really mind-blowing idea. When a sperm meets an egg, they connect and they start dividing, but when they divide, they're all the same cell. And then somehow or another, they turn into all of these different patterns and shapes in the body. And Turing was blown away by this idea and because he was a mathematician, he started to apply this, his math understanding to how cells took shape and how they formed eyes and hands and fingers and toes and livers and bone and all the other various components of the body. And what he found was underneath all of these zillions, countless patterns in the body, you have the same basic equations. And he actually applied this theory to help the Allies win World War II. That's what the movie was about, the imitation game. Imitation, or the, uh, the imitation game is what the name of the movie was. Well, talk about this when we come back from our break. Our number is 844-236-6010. Got lines open for you. I'm Pharmacist Ben. You're listening to The Bright Side. We'll be back after this. You are listening to GCN. 
Visit GCNlive.com today. All right, we're back on the bright side. Thanks for joining us. 844-236-6010 is our number. If you have questions about health or nutrition or prescription drugs, if you're dealing with a chronic health challenge, chronic degenerative disease, or you know somebody who's dealing with a chronic degenerative disease, let us show you how simple and easy it can be to reverse anything, really, in the way of chronic degenerative health challenges because it's in the body's nature to heal. The body wants to heal. It's looking to heal as everything is, plants and bones, and any living system is always looking to heal. When something breaks, it repairs. It's as simple as that. That's just how, the, that's how everything in the universe works. When it breaks, uh, every living thing in the universe works. That could cons- be considered the very definition of life. You know, non-living things, when they break, they just break. But living things not only repair themselves when they break. This is so cool. Not only do living systems repair themselves when they break, they repair themselves better and stronger and more resilient. And that's true about trees and plants. And it's true about skin and bones. It's true about us. We repair. Not We don't merely repair. We repair better. That is so unbelievable. And that is a physical principle that is part of something called complexity theory. Systems become more complex. Systems become more robust, more resilient when they're stressed. It's how exercise works. They call it hormesis in biochemistry, H-O-R-M-E-S-I-S. It's the idea that when a living system is stressed, it gets better. You know, they can actually inject inflammatory factors into your knee to improve arthritis symptoms. It's called prolotherapy. It's how uh, exfoliation works to improve skin health. You stimulate the skin. People say, oh, I don't want to exfoliate. It's too irritating. No, you stimulate the skin, you get more collagen. For people who are afraid to stimulate the skin with alpha hydroxy acids or retinol or, or even washcloth, and you hear sometimes people saying, oh, be very gentle on the skin. They don't understand hormesis. They don't understand complexity theory. They don't understand the nature of the life force, which is to get better when it's stressed. That's, that alone is the ultimate miracle. Can you imagine you take your car and you go off in the mountains, you go four-wheeling, and you, you tear it all up, and you go off-road, etc. And then you come back, and you park your little car in the garage, and the next day, it's like this big old Jeep. That would be a miracle. You'd say it was a miracle. Well, the same miracle happens in the body. You break a bone, and the bone is stronger at the point of the break. This can be exploited if you're dealing with a chronic health challenge. Anyway, 844-236-6010 is our number. Alan Turing, the father of the modern computer, father of computer science, was a brilliant mathematician at the, uh, in the early part of the 20th century. He's credited with solving, uh, with uh, uh, helping the British win World War II by solving what was called the Enigma Code, which was the German top secret code, and he solved it by using simple mathematics. He came up with the idea that there was these simple patterns underneath all complex shapes, all complexity. And by the way, this idea is so powerful for us because it says that if you want to create a complex shape, whether that complex shape is health, or whether the complex complex shape is the human body, or whether the complex shape is a, a wall, whatever the complex shape you're trying to create is, you only need to go to the bricks. You only need to go to the simple building blocks. This is what the triangle of disease is about. Whatever your disease is, backtrack to the simple building blocks, the triangle of disease, the digestive system, the blood sugar system, and what I call the thyroid adrenal complex. Behind all the crazy thousands, 12,000 different diseases, chronic degenerative diseases, you're always going to find the same basic things. Inflammation, starvation, suffocation, toxification, all at the cell level. We've talked about this for years here on the bright side. It's, called, it's part of what's known as chaos theory, complexity theory. And it's hardcore physics, hardcore mathematics, and it's what the bright side is all about. Yesterday we talked about diabetes. Diabetes is the third leading cause of death in this country. You could actually call it the first leading cause of death in this country if you factor in heart disease. But by making a few simple moves, we can completely eliminate it. Completely. It's 100% reversible because it's a process that only needs to be turned around. Dr. Wallach used to make people go crazy when he said, I can reverse diabetes. And he was right. It wasn't him, but his ideas. 
Diabetes is 100% reversible, and it makes sense once we understand this idea of simplexity.